Hi, welcome to Tech Tips and Tech Stuff. My name is Ron, and today I want to show you how to stop Norton 360 from bugging you with these damn notifications. So let's begin. Go down to your system tray, select Norton 360, click it once. And it comes up with Classic. If you don't see Classic, you, you need this page here to do the uh, changes on it. If you, if you see this screen here, this screen here, if you see this screen here, go to Settings, Launch, View, and select Classic. Select Classic, close it out. If it doesn't appear, you may have to go back down there and click on this little icon again. So this is what you want to see, the classic view. Now to just change these settings, go into settings, administrative settings. Now here is where you want to do your changes. A lot of these things don't need to be on, but they're all on by default. So background, you see, can't really change this here. Background task, idle time, optimizer, I leave it on. Report card, I turn it off. Shortcut key, turn it on, leave it on, not a big deal. You want to make it stop bugging you for, for bugging you when it's doing system idle scans and all this stuff. Um, network, community watch, off. Remote management, off. Norton task notification, off, definitely. It will stop bugging you a lot. Performance monitoring, I left it off. Power save mode for desktops, leave it off. Norton product tamper protection on. Um, setting password protection, I leave mine off, which is just my preference. Silent mode is off. Full screen detection on. This one's on as well. Now the big one here is this here, special offer notification. That's where Norton's going to come back with uh, Upgrades or Norton you trying to tell you to sell you Norton utilities. Make sure this is set to off. I put my uh, cleanup, temporary cleanup is off, and cleanup history is off. I use a different program for that. Click apply, close, and Norton should stop bugging you. This will reduce your notifications probably about 80% from Norton. If you found this video helpful in any way, Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and as always, thank you for watching.